awesome year over there, like going to England. I've always wanted to go to BSB as an Aussie. You see like Brooksy and O'Hara and those sort of guys that have gone over there in the past and done well. So for me, yeah, getting to go over there and do a full year, like we tested in Spain and stuff with a really good team, obviously with the Macadam Yamaha team. It was just yeah, so lucky to get the gig to go over and yeah, just sort of took the opportunity and did the best I could all year. and. Yeah, ended up third in the championship, which I'm stoked with. Like, we were sort of chipping away at it. There were weekends where I hadn't been to, never seen the track before, so Friday morning we were learning the track, and as the weekend went on, you know, you get better and better, and by the end of the weekend you're, you know, fighting for the podium, basically. So, yeah, it's definitely a challenging place to go racing. The tracks, obviously everyone knows the tracks are up and down, um, bumpy, the weather's always not so nice. So, yeah, like, I yeah, loved my time over there. I, it was with a great team, I met a lot of great people, so yeah, hopefully for me getting over there again and now that I've done the rounds, I know the track um, and, I, and I've got a lot more support over there, it'd be great to have a stab at winning the championship, so yeah, like honestly, getting like the opportunity to go and race there and see the level and like just being excited to go racing every weekend was such a good thing, so yeah, I really enjoyed it. As an Aussie, like I said, with those other guys that have gone over there and sort of yeah, they've just built themselves a, a great spot in BSB and they're, you know, every weekend making a, a pretty good living. So, I don't know, as a motorbike racer, I think I'm 23 now. It'd, it'd be nice to have a go at it at least in the next year or two. And if it doesn't work out, come back and race in Australia. It's, it's that simple. So, yeah, I did, I did um, like I said, I met a lot of, like I know a lot of people there now. After, after being there for a year, you just kind of get to know everyone. And I'd, yeah, I'd like to, I haven't got a ride sorted yet for next year, but I'd like to think that I can find myself somewhere in the next couple of weeks to get back over there. I think it's just a bit more easy as an Aussie, you speak the language and you know, it's similar people like, um, so yeah, it's definitely a good place to be. And a great run championship, they do a really good job of it. Yeah, so I was just lucky, um, Robbie Bolger rang me up, must have been probably three or four months ago now and he was like, what are you doing, do you want to come race when you get back? I'm like, mate, 100%. I probably would have done it myself, I'm like just ridden around just for the, the bike time. Um, we're lucky here in Australia that um, we can ride throughout summer and then go back to England and ride in their summer. So I want to spend all the time here I can riding. So when Robbie gave me the call to come, I was like, mate, 100%. Um, and then he was like, we'll get, we'll get an R1 ready and a 600 ready. So I've just been lucky enough to end up with a yeah, great, great little team here that they put together. Bikes are really good. And today and yesterday, I really just like the brand new bikes were just sort of ironing out. It's like the first day of winter testing, well, first day of testing at the start of the year, really, for us. So yeah, just playing around with with a few settings and stuff like that and um, yeah just I'm enjoying it really it's good to be back in Australia like I've only been home for seven days now so just enjoying being back in the sunshine and, and with my family and stuff like that so yeah really enjoying being back also with Cube Racing who I've been with in the past and, and get along really well with and have known really well so yeah it's good to good to be back racing ASBK. I'm enjoying riding the, the R1 it's just so much it's got so much more power and it's like being in Australia, you race like seeing the other guys that are all super bikes here. It's where, where I want to be. When I come home, I want to be riding with those boys. So um, even in the last day and a, day and a bit, that session then, I've followed some guys around and every session going forwards, we're not really like turning the bike inside out. We're just sort of making sure everything's all good. And yeah, I'm really enjoying it. And hopefully I can just continue to take, every time we put a new tyre in, I just want to make another little step, another little step. And then yeah, but hopefully Taylor and Ben, we can roll it out and be sort of competitive.